It's well known that wind speeds are often higher over ocean than over land. And it's not known whether the wind speeds are higher over oceans just because there's less drag forces. On land, you have things like buildings and trees and mountains slowing down the wind, whereas the ocean is smooth. And so the question is, if you put a bunch of wind turbines over the ocean, is that going to slow down the wind so much that it's no better than putting wind turbines on land? And so a postdoc working in my group, Anna Posner, did some simulations using a climate model and found that there really is something special about some regions of the ocean that make them better places to extract wind power. And that is that some parts of the ocean have heat coming out of the ocean. And where the heat comes out of the ocean, it sets up these big temperature contrasts. And that increases the amount of storminess and cyclonic activity and brings down wind energy from higher in the atmosphere. And so in these simulations, we found that the, the land-based wind farms extracted energy mostly from the lowest, lowest levels of the atmosphere, whereas the open ocean wind farms were able to extract energy through much of the atmospheric column overlying the wind farm. And so the study really suggests that there's a huge potential for wind power from open ocean wind farms.